Hello souls, how are you? It's time for another miraculous reading. Today we're going to make another missing person reading and by viewer's request I'm going to check the case of Maura Murray. As usual we are going to check what actually happened to her, where she can be found at is she going to be found at all? And uh, who is responsible for her disappearance? So if you're curious, stay till the end of this video. And please don't forget to like and subscribe. I remind you that all the information in this video is alleged. So let's start with the main question. What actually led to Maura, Maura's disappearance. Let's see how the cards are going to show us this situation and all the events that led to her disappearance. So we have six of cups, two of swords, eight of wands, two of wands, and the chariot. So we have situation from her past. The six of cups symbolizes the past and she didn't want to deceit she didn't want the situation to repeat itself and she somehow didn't see an exit from the situation like uh, let me show you this is the situation that uh, happened in her past and she didn't know how to exit from it so she was concentrated in thinking about a possible solution and she was having two options to choose from. And she didn't uh, speak with anybody about this. Then she took fast decision and moved fast. The eight of wands represents movement. And she has contacted somebody on a distance. She um, she was planning to go to somebody, and she uh, she was planning to go and visit someone. And this person was not made aware, however, of her visit, and she went there. What happened next? Queen of Swords, Lovers, once again she was choosing between two options and she appears as somebody who is a very logical person with a strong mindset and uh, very intelligent. She appears as the Queen of Swords, but she was doubtful about her decision and uh, there was also inner conflict on what path to take. Knight of Pentacles and Ten of Wands. So 
so she felt like uh, this situation is uh, something she should handle by her own and she took some money with her and but uh, was very very difficult for her she felt it uh, like a, a big burden that she's carrying on her back and uh, somehow she was expecting to move forward carrying this burden what is this what is this situation difficult situation she she was thinking about what was this decision related to very stressful situation magician once again queen of swords and that we have also queen of pentacles so she was very upset about something she wanted to cut out she wanted to put an end to something and she was very stressed out she she wanted uh, the queen of pentacles usually represents um, the housewife and uh, also the motherly figure she's just below the empress and uh, she didn't want to be that figure she wanted to be the intellectual one and she decided to put an end to this situation i believe she was pregnant or she believed that she was pregnant and somehow this was a very fatal decision that she made for her why she was uh, directed to this location why she wanted to go there what was the place about what was there that she wanted to find what she was looking for six of pentacles money king of cups empress and the empress usually is pregnant king of cups uh, could mean uh, a man who understands her and who is loving this could be somebody from her family somebody who she trusts and uh, this was a person who could give her money as well like um, additional finances for something and this is this is once again person from her past and this is a situation that uh, she already experienced in her past. This is not a new situation. She was at some point in that location or communicating years ago, years before with somebody in that location. What happened next?
Ace of Swords, Queen of Wands. Once again, we see her very active. She decided to be active to take uh, things in her own head, uh, hands and uh, with the Ace of Swords, uh, she was decided to put an end of this situation. The Moon, we see her in the woods alone and uh, we also see that there were animals behind her. So she, mm, I believe that once her car crashed, she walked in the woods and uh, there were wild animals she didn't notice. And with the star card we have also just another image that represents the soul. Is she still alive? Is more still alive? Two of Pentacles, Four of Swords. No, she's resting. She, her body is resting. The Four of Swords usually is represented by a person lying in, um, in a chapel. So she's also being buried. Perhaps somebody found her body and uh, buried her as a known person or something like this. Mm. With this uh, Two of Pentacles, I think that she was being buried under somebody else's name. But we also have Two of Wands, so she's been mistaken for somebody else. Once again, uh, each one to each one uh, represents physical body and she was uh, buried under somebody else's name and she was not alone. If she was pregnant, uh, this could be the answer with whom she was. Let's ask another question. Where she can be found at right now, like direction compared to the location where her car was found at. Where she can be found. What? King of Swords, the Emperor, the world. Four of Pentacles, this is the car and the engine, the distance, page of swords, chariot, once again the car, king of cups, queen of Pentacles, so cups, Cups means east and pentacles means west, but king is a uh, higher position compared to the queen. So let's ask for another card. Four of wands, strength, nine of swords. Three of Wands, Seven of Swords. I'm looking for an Ace. And this Ace will indicate the correct location. We have Ace of Pentacles. 
So it's um, direction west compared to her car, to the place her car was found at. Um, police should look at west. And how many miles, more or less, to the west? Zero. It's like an uh, area that she, they should look at. So it's in the woods and uh, within eight miles distance. But it's in a wooded area. It could be perhaps private cemetery or something like this. the direction west in the woods this is the clarification is she going to be found or identified if she's already buried under another person's name what will happen tower the answer is no and uh, let's ask maura if she wants to be channeled and if she wants to send a message to somebody. No. So that was today's reading, my dear souls. Thank you very much for watching it till the end. If you like this reading, give me a thumbs up, share, subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.